Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa salam amma ba'd I urge myself and urge others to strive to help alleviate the suffering of humanity in places like Somalia in which we're experiencing now a very severe uh, crisis a, a human crisis in fact in fact when you see a child starving to death and you see that animals are waiting and hovering above a human being to expire in order to partake and eat from that human being then you know that we are in a crisis so it is up to us it is up to us who have something to offer to offer it to offer the help in which we can as a Muslim, at the minimum you can do is at least supplicate for the suffering. Supplicate for those people who are less fortunate to you, less fortunate than you. Supplicate, supplicate for those people who are fasting but unintentionally. You're fasting, if you're fasting the month of Ramadan, you're fasting intentionally. But what about those people who are fasting in, and it isn't even in the true meaning and spirit of fasting, but rather they are not eating and drinking because they have nothing. So, we have a responsibility as human beings, and we have a responsibility as Muslims to try to alleviate suffer in the wor- suffering in the world. Because there will come a day when you will not have the opportunity to spend and purify your wealth. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, فَمَا لَهُمْ مِنْ قُوَّةٍ وَلَا نَاسِرٍ Allah tabarak wa ta'ala says in the Qur'an, He says that there, there will be a time when a person will have no strength. They will have no, nothing within, in, in their being. Because why? They will be deceased. وَلَا نَاسِرٍ And no one will be able to help them. When you're on your deathbed, no one can, can sustain you. And on the day of judgment, in which this ayat, this verse is revealed about, you will have no more opportunity to do good deeds in this life. But rather, you will be in need of what you did in this life to help you as provisions. So this is a time to help ourselves for that day when we will receive no help and no one can help us by spending, spending some charity, spending in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by sustaining by helping someone else sustain themselves. So I ask Allah Tabarak wa ta'ala by all of His divine names and attributes to bless us to be of those people to encourage others to spend in His cause and to bless us to be of those people to spend in His cause. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help and alleviate the suffering of those people who are less fortunate, those people who are starving and those children who are dying. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Bless them and grant them relief in their very struggles. And those who pass, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy upon them. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have mercy upon us. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad.